Proceed to Hamburg, West Germany and rendezvous with Thomas Goodman, an operative from Unity's American branch. Goodman may have information concerning Dr. Schenker's whereabouts. The rendezvous will take place at Das Einsame Valkyrie, a popular beatnik nightclub in Hamburg. You will recognize Agent Goodman by his rugged good looks and the unlit cigarette he is holding in his left hand. Offer him a light. He will answer with, sorry, but I don't smoke. Once you have made contact, you will be under Agent Goodman's command. Follow his orders implicitly. How am I going to get in there? I demand to be let in. I'm sorry, that's impossible. But my girlfriend is inside. I understand that, but they can't let you in. Can I at least go find her? Sadly, no. Why not? Because the club is full. Nobody else is allowed. Well, can you go find her for me? I must stay here. Then can you send someone to find her? Everyone is busy. You will just have to wait. I want to speak to someone in charge. As I said, everyone is busy. If you come back tomorrow after 10 a.m., perhaps you can speak with someone then. But my girlfriend is in there now. Perhaps you should have come together. Then you would not be in this situation, and I would not have to listen to you shouting at me. I'm just getting warmed up. It's not my fault that you're out here and she is in there. It is your fault. She is your girlfriend. You should have known better than to ask her to wait for you inside a club that is known to fill up every single night. Can I please just go and find her? I said no and I meant it. Now go away or I will call the police. Schweinhund. Scheiß Kopf. Is it always as crowded? Yeah. The place fills up every night. People come for the music. Do you think they'll let us in? I doubt it. I have to get in there. Really? Well, let me help you. I'll distract the bouncer so you can climb in through that window. Watch out for the camera, though. Thanks. My pleasure. Have fun. Nice cough. Hello, big boy. Well, hello there. It sure is crowded tonight. It usually is. This place is very popular. You must meet a lot of pretty girls. Yes, but rarely do I meet enchanting ones. You're teasing. I do not tease. Promises, promises. I get off in an hour. Then so do... <laughs> you will excuse me. This is all I have time for this evening. Thank you, thank you. Perhaps I will sing for you later. What is so important you need to interrupt me in the middle of a performance? You know how these people treasure my concerts. Now they will lament. Das tut mir leid, Fräulein Wagner. 
Of course, if they are sad, they will buy more drinks to drown their sorrows, which is good for business. But it troubles me to know that someone is unhappy because I was unable to give enough of myself. A gift like mine comes with terrible responsibility, you know. Yeah, and you have so much of yourself to give. Even such pathetic, horrible creatures as these smelly beatniks deserve some sympathy, yeah? Now then, perhaps you will care to remind me why I am talking instead of singing. Fräulein Wagner, the super spy is here. What should we do? So, the fly has run the doorbell of the spider. You did the right thing. Let her have a few drinks. Then she goes to the water closet. Grab her and bring her to me. Am I understood? Jawohl. Good. Watch her closely. She is not to leave under any circumstances. It will be done as you have asked. If you succeed, perhaps I will be convinced to sing for you. Would you like that? Very much so, Fräulein Wagner. It would be a great honor. Then make me happy. When I am happy, I sing like a night in gale in springtime. I love your outfit. These I cramps are killing Can me. Can I talk you out of it? <laughs> Leave me alone! Perhaps it's just me, but I thought the music was terrible. How can you say that? It's unconventional, certainly, but that's what makes it so compelling. It's not compelling, it's just bad. This club is well, super groovy, do don't you think so? Maybe it's just too sophisticated. The show ended early tonight. I hope there's another set later. your outfit. I do too. Can I talk you out of it? <laughs> Perhaps it's just me. But I thought the music was terrible. Maybe it's just too sophisticated for my taste. Personally, I like music that has Oh. <laughs> 
Would you care for a light? Thanks, but I don't smoke. You're holding a cigarette. Am I? Well, what do you know? I guess old habits die hard. Say, can I borrow a dime? I want to call my mom and tell her I just met the girl of my dreams. I gave my last dime to a worthwhile charity. Ouch. I wasn't expecting a woman. You weren't briefed. They just said meet Agent Archer at 8 p.m. Well, I'm Agent Archer. So I gathered. Didn't the code phrase tip you off? I thought it was a little unusual, but I figured, hey, it's Europe. Things are different over here. Scotch and soda. Will you have a drink? Old Granddad, bring the bottle, a tumbler, and a bowl of ice. Goodness, are you celebrating? Compensating, actually. How sad for you. So tell me, Ms. Archer. Oh, now don't start with that. What? There's no need to patronize me. Was I patronizing you? Yes, you were. Well, I'm sorry, but I didn't realize I was going to have to babysit on this assignment. I may be a woman, but that doesn't mean I can't take care of myself. Oh, I get it. You're one of those women's livers. Dress up in men's clothing, ride motorcycles, smoke cigars, that kind of thing. Just because I can take care of myself doesn't mean I'm not a woman. They're not mutually exclusive, you know. But isn't the point of women's liberation to allow young ladies like yourself to become men? The point is to allow young ladies to become whatever they please. Ouch. Well, if you're as deadly with a pistol as you are with your tongue, you can watch both our backs. All right, I will. So what's the plan? Well, the first thing is to find out who the goon is. Excuse me? You're being watched. If you can lure him someplace quiet, I'll jump him and find out what he's after. That's very noble of you, but I think I can handle that little fella. Suit yourself. Where should I ambush him? Try the ladies' room. What? You think he'll follow me into the loo? Heck yeah, look at him. He's concentrating so hard on not being noticed, he'd probably follow you into heavy traffic without a second thought. Anyway, you'll certainly be justified interrogating him, won't you? I'd be justified in doing worse than that. Just make sure you question him first. I'll be waiting by the stage. Be wary of the operetta. It's a bit enthusiastic. I can take it. for someone?
Here she comes! Oh, 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 Thanks, miss. I owe you my life. Just keep your head down till this is over. What's going on? Did you hear that? Someone could have sworn I heard something over there. What's this? Yeah, don't. You okay? I suppose, although I think someone might have tried to drug me. Something stung the back of my neck as I was heading for the ladies' room. Might have been a dart. How do you feel now? Not bad. Meet me at this address in one hour. Why not go together? I want to poke around and see who these people are. They may be linked to harm. Are you sure it's safe? Hell no. It's reckless and dumb, but that's not going to stop me. Well, good luck then. What should I do if you don't make it? Don't worry, doll. I'll make it. If you say so. Head backstage. A friend of mine's waiting in the alley. He'll get you out of here. Just tell him you're with me. You think he'll believe me? He will if you tell him my code name. I don't know your code name. Bold Eagle. <laughs> Good God. What's so funny? Nothing. See you later, Bold Eagle. Not if I see you first. Okay. I guess I'll have to improvise. What's in all those cakes anyway? Beer! We supply Harm's entire staff with the finest Deutsch brews. Really? 
That must be a lot of beer. Indeed. Our studies show that criminals drink three times as much alcohol as law-abiding citizens. So beer turns... Be We will meet again, Dark. And I will play!